A man asks questions about the world around him from the very beginning. Why is the sky blue and the grass green? How did people come into being? Cartoon SpongeBob gave us another question. Who lives at the bottom of the ocean? And I assure you, after watching this video, these words will give you the creeps to run to your skin. Because besides sea stars and harmless clams, you can come across something much more mysterious and dangerous in the depths. Let's begin. Walking along the ocean coast, especially in Florida, in mid-autumn is a great pleasure. But even then, life can bring a surprise. Gino Kovacci, looking at the ocean, could not expect to see what came under his feet. It was an enormous eye of at least 10 centimeters in diameter. Blood was oozing out of it, so to assume that this case was done by a man would be wrong. Gino kept it in his refrigerator for a few days and then handed it over to the police. But this discovery caused a shock in the scientific society because it didn't fit in with the idea of who it could belong to. To this day, theories are still being put forward that the eyes attributed to both the snowman and the giant octopus, but the mystery has not been solved until nowadays. The ninth place at the top is occupied by a frilled shark. This creature, although it belongs to a family of sharks, looks quite unusual and does not resemble any of its congeners. Its body length varies from a meter to two meters at the same time. Its structure is more like a snake. Similarity with the snake adds to the structure of the jaw. They are long and mobile, which allows it to swallow the whole prey. Besides the teeth, directed towards the throat, preventing the prey from slipping. This shark was discovered in the year 1881 by Ludwig Doderlein. He immediately recognized that this creature may be a danger to humans if encountered in the depths of the ocean. The mystery supports the fact that the first photo of this shark appeared only in the year 2004. In Japan, the field shark is considered one of the oldest creatures, which is a harbinger of troubles such as tsunamis or earthquakes. Well, the first one is quite true, because the field shark is older than dinosaurs. There are a lot of difficulties faced while trying to explain mysteries about the ocean. There are also scary things. We will talk about these a little later. Also. There are incomprehensible things about the ocean. For example, how do you explain the presence of two ancient locomotives at a depth of 30 meters discovered in the 19th century? This curiosity is near the shores of New Jersey. No historical document talks absolutely about these trains. We cannot even assume that there was a plan to lay a railway, because submarine railways in the 19th century was out of the question. On the other hand, there are no tracks close to the ocean that locomotives could be there as a result of an accident. It is only a mystery. There's a theory that before human civilization began its development, representatives of a slightly different culture lived on Earth. They did not differ much from people, except for one sign. They were all giants. This is confirmed both in ancient stories about the struggle against titans and giants, and in an excavation which do not always meet the expectations of scientists. For example, in the well-known Neanderthal, stands the remains of a two-meter-long leg is found. All this is also confirmed by the next discovery, which deserves a place in our top, a giant knife which was found in 2014 by a group of divers. The photo shows three divers holding this giant primitive stone weapon. No one can even offer an adequate explanation for how this could have ended up in the ocean. The ocean is like a giant beast with insatiable hunger. In the history of mankind, it has absorbed many ships. Still, none can compare in its tragedy with the death of the Titanic in 1912. It is at a depth of 3,800 meters in the Atlantic Ocean. It is a mysterious place, where you can see the realities of the time. Even if covered with algae and shellfish, decks and pipes, cables and anchors, holds and cabins, all these still exist. However, expeditions are not often equipped to the Titanic. And alas, now the ship is slowly being destroyed. Thus, the diver and historian Park Stevenson regretfully stated that his favorite places for photographs are already destroyed by salt, current, and sea life. Do you remember the movie The Hobbit? In a big battle there once took part giant worms, which broke right out of the ground and devoured people orcs, dwarves, and elves. I wish that such creature would never appear on Earth. Well, whatever. They were successfully placed in the fifth place to our top 
Australian multibristle worms, otherwise known as bobbit worms or Unicea prodytuus, reach a length of 2 to 3 meters and live in shallow water depths up to 40 meters. They bury themselves in the sand and wait for their victims. When a fish passes by, the worm explodes upwards with a sharp movement, grabs it with its powerful jaws, and drags it into itself. It looks very creepy and you want to believe that we will never find representatives of this family this big. What else can you find deep in the ocean? Animals? Sculptures? Shipwrecks? By the way, do you want a mug of beer? It was a bottle of beer that the Canadian explorer John Cruz from Halifax came across. Shrugging his shoulders, he threw it to the rest of his findings, most of which had no prize but are waiting for a place in the museum. However, after taking a closer look, he realized that he was holding in his hands a product of the local brewery of Alexander Kate. Only, the products were more than a hundred years old, as it was mentioned at the bottom of the bottle. The beer was produced in the year 1890, and what was quite unexpected was that it remained inside. The liquid with gaseous balls of yellow color of a hundred years old was present indeed. This discovery could not be missed without sharing with the public. And if you want to get rich, the instructions for you have been prepared by guys from the third place in the top. Divers from Florida managed to find the sunken gold in the waters near the peninsula for a million dollars. It was here that a battle took place in the year 1715, as a result of which 11 Spanish ships were sunk, which contained a lot of gold and jewelry. This fact attracts hundreds and thousands of enthusiasts from around the world every year, usually. Nothing can be found, but these guys know their business. Oh, by the way, half of the amount in which they evaluated the treasure they found in a single gold coin that was made personally for King Philip V of Spain. And now imagine that you took the necessary equipment and decided to do a little scuba diving. No, not in the terrible ocean depths, but in a small lake in Minnesota. So you slowly dive to the bottom, looking at rocks, algae, and fish, and... You find yourself face to face with a creepy maniac, a killer in a hockey mask, with Jason Voorhees from the movie Friday the 13th. Someone decided to tickle the diver's nerves thoroughly and threw a statue of the very character of the horror movie into the water. Quite a gloomy and creepy joke, isn't it? It's not difficult to find it, if you know the right minds. But they say it is at a depth of about 33 meters, and if you're ready to see a suddenly flashlight in the slot of a mask, then try Jason. He'll be happy to have you there. And the leader of our top, as could be supposed, because the most scary, mysterious, and unsolved object of His Majesty, the ocean, the Bermuda Triangle. It is located between Miami, Bermuda, and Puerto Rico. Despite the logical explanations of some of the disasters associated with shoals, cyclones, and storms that characterize the area, Nothing can be done about the unexplained disappearances. Thus, in the year 1945, the link of bombers of the Ewinger, consisting of five planes, disappeared here. The wreckage was not found, or the disappearance of the C-119 aircraft. However, despite the scary secrets of this area, there are a large number of tourist sites underwater. At least, a shipwreck with huge reserves of 200 years of wine. Many are ready to dive after it, only if they will return from such a dangerous place. Who knows? Anyway, there's nothing better than to enjoy the evening surf, lying on the warm sand on the ocean shore, even if you know that somewhere in its depth, it's something mysterious and unusual. And in the meantime, we will tell you only interesting stuff. We're waiting for your subscription to the channel and of course, hit the like button below. It motivates us to go even further in exploring the unknown. Goodbye, everyone.